Kenyan police used tear gas to disperse protesters in the capital Nairobi on Tuesday, as nationwide demonstrations have continued into a third week. The ongoing unrest comes despite Kenyan President William Ruto withdrawing a controversial finance bill and dismissing his cabinet in response to protesters' demands. Uh, I just want my, my voice to be heard. And I just want the president to know that we don't want what he's doing. Like, the economy is just bad and we don't like it. The protests were prompted by anger at proposed tax increases and a government that many, mostly young demonstrators, feel is not listening to them. This is our land. We are dying here. We get justice or we die here. And the irreversible minimum is, is either the president abide by what the people are telling him. We gave him that power. People's it is power. time People's for power. him to abide by what we are telling him. Or... We demand IMF to come and carry their own puppet. Ruto dismissed most of his cabinet last Thursday and promised to form a new government that will be lean and efficient. With more than 30 deaths during the unrest, protesters have also called for the president to resign.